to a new video. In today's video, I'm going to be using my Madame Glam gel polishes to create a fun, bright set of nails. Um, so, the this I just need to say before I start this set of nails, I I um, it's basically a recreation set. Um, there was a lady in my group on Facebook called Carleen. I think it's Carleen Villarreal. I don't know if I'm saying it right, but I hope I am. Um, she posted a set of beautiful bright nails. And um, I just wanted to recreate them because I thought they were perfect for summer. So I'm using my Madame Glam gel polishes today. Um, I've got perfect yellow and green highlighter for the first nail. So what I'm doing is I'm doing like a rainbow across the nails. And each nail is going to have two different colours on either side. And then across the middle, I'm going to use pigments and glitter to create to yeah it's going to be it's going to go down the center so you don't have to worry that the like you see where my colors meet in the middle you don't have to ombre them or anything like that they don't have to be neat um as long as where they meet there's enough room it you you want to make sure it's kind of like down right down the center because that's where we're going to put our pigments i think that makes sense so this blue is called, um, I think it's Besame. I don't know if I'm saying it right, but it's one of the, it's the blue from Madame Glam's latest collection. Uh, I really like it. So you can see we've gone from yellow to green. Um, and then now we're going to do green and blue. And then the next now will be blue and purple. And then the last now will be purple and pink. So we're, we're kind of going through the spectrum. Do you, do you, do you know what I mean? Um, so on each nail as well, we're going to do two coats. So I think this is my second coat. That's going to go in the lamp. Yeah, okay, so that was the second coat. So now this, this nail is going to be the blue and purple. So the purple one, the purple gel polish I'm using is the Perfect Purple. Now the Perfect Purple does show up a little bit sheer. So I, I'm only going to do two coats, but you may want to do three. But two, I mean, two was okay for me. Okay, and the Madame Glam gel polishes cure in an LED lamp for 30 seconds. So each layer will have a 30 second cure. If you're using an um, a UV lamp, I think they need two minutes. I do have a... 30% uh, off code as well for Madam Glam. It's NatMug30. Um, if you want to, you can become a VIP member. Um, I've, I screenshot a photo, actually. I'll put it up. Um, hang on. That was Barbie Girl. I just want to show you that first. So I'm just going to put a screenshot here. So this is everything that you get when you subscribe to their VIP program thing. You get 50% off everything. Um, you get a sneak peek into like new releases so all what they do is they take $29 from your account every month and that will stay in your Madam Glam account as store credit and you can build that up or you can spend it every month um I I would quite like to save it up over like a few months and then get like a massive haul that would be amazing but you know do whatever you want but all the time you're doing that you do save 50 percent off everything on their website and if you don't want to do that if you don't want them to take money out of your account every month you can still get the 30 percent discount using that mug 30 which is still a pretty good saving and to be honest a lot of the time they have if you go on their website you can save 40% a lot of the time if you like sometimes if you purchase more than like six gel polishes you 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 get like 40% I don't know but they have they have really good savings and with the savings the, they work out at a, an amazing price and also they're like 21 free they're vegan they're cruelty free there's it's such a um what's the right word ethical an ethical brand i don't know if that's the right word but they are they're amazing in my opinion and they're beautiful gel polishes to work with so i would thoroughly bloody recommend them <laughs> i'm going over now with the no wipe top coat and this is gonna just fin not finish off the nails but we're, we're just gonna seal the, the colors in with the, the top coat and then we can work on top of this with our pigments this is also going to just smooth out the nails in the center like where the two colors meet 
not that it really matters too much because it, like as i said before we are going to work down the center of the nails with um, actually i'm going to use the gel paint madam glam now do gel paints i haven't done a video on the gel paints yet but i've used them have i I, I'm, I think i'm doing yeah i'm doing another set this week using the gel i love gel paints you know i love gel paints so i'm really really excited that madam glam have finally brought out gel paints they brought out 12 colors i'll show you them in another video but this is the white one i'm going to be using today they come in these little pots they are a lot more pigmented than the, the gel polishes are nicely pigmented like the white for instance but this these are a, like they're more pigmented they're a little bit thicker so they're they're um they're like easier to work with if you're doing like designs or thin lines and stuff like that um also because they are a lot more pigmented they do need a 60 second cure but that's i mean that's not a problem um yeah, I'll tell you some more about them in another video, actually. I will have to... It will probably be next week now. But I, you will see me... You will see me... Uh, you will see me use them in, in videos between now and then. So you can see I've got my white line, my white stripe down the centre. So this is just going to cover up where the two colours meet in the middle. So it's just going to make everything a bit more neat. And we're going to... Because we're going to go on with the pigments, what I'm going to do is... I'm going to cure this for 10 seconds. So we're not giving it a full cure. It's just being cured for 10 seconds. Like a quick flash cure. And then into the white gel polish, I'm using the Nail Sugar Neon Pigments. And I'm going to start at the bottom. And again, I'm going to go through kind of like, we're going to do like a rainbow. We're going to go through like the spectrum of colours. I don't know if that's the right words. But we're going to start with the yellow and then working up, we're going to go green and then we're going to go blue and then we're going to go purple and then we're going to go pink. So kind of like what we've done on the tips, only we're going up with the pigments. These are really, really pigmented. You only need the smallest amount of the pigment on your brush. You'll see where I've wiped them off on the paper towel. You're just left. There's loads of pigment on that. You, like and I've used a ridiculously small amount of the pigment can you see like it's crazy so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to just gently brush off the excess pigment don't worry at this point I, I shouldn't have worried too much yet you can see where I've top coated either side you can see the pigment has kind of stained the top coat don't worry about that I mean I've I'm wiping it off now with some um cleanser but you don't have to worry about this until we finish top coating the pigment in the middle because I got a little bit carried away using the cleanser on the wipe and I accidentally removed there. Can you see I removed a little bit of the pigment but I can't now go back on to that with pigment because it's lost its tackiness. So clean the nail, clean the pigment off the nail afterwards. I think I'm making sense. Right, I'm gonna put a little bit of no wipe top coat on my palette. And then using the Nail Sugar Natalie Muggridge Detailer Brush, I'm going to seal the pigment in using the top coat. Now you want to make sure when you're doing this bit that you don't flood. Like you want to make sure that you cover the pigment, but you don't really want to go outside of the white line that you created. Because otherwise, you'll see in a minute, perfect example, because I'll do it in a minute. Where my top coat has run a little bit, it's it, where I've, and then I've sugared it. It's not a completely straight dead line down the center. You'll see in a minute. So I'm sugaring the top coat now before I cure it. And when I sugar, I do like to cure, I do like to do a double cure. So when that comes out, I'm I, when I sugar as well, I like to just brush over the top with a hard brush. Now, can you see? On the right hand side i've i've sort of gone over the pigment a little bit and it's gone onto the polish gel polish but anyway i'm gonna fit i'm gonna do the same thing on all the other nails and this is the this these are them finished really um i hope you like them do join my group and check out um carlene's nails because this is where i got the inspiration well i didn't get the inspiration i basically recreated them <laughs> 
but thank you for watching i hope you like this video if you did please leave me a like if you haven't already do consider subscribing don't forget to hit that notification bell and i will see you beautiful lot tomorrow with another video yeah i think that's it love you all bye